Welcome to Waiting Into Retirement. I'm Mike. And I'm Laura. And uh, we're here to share some experiences with you. So just by way of introduction, um, I work in, uh, in healthcare. Uh, we both live in Kingston, Ontario, Canada. And um, Laura, where do you work? I work in healthcare currently, but actually I work at this table during the week. Yes, Laura has the privilege of being a remote worker right now where I am uh, predominantly in the office. Um, so, so what are we doing here? You're probably wondering um, why we're recording ourselves. I think um, we've, to use a football analogy, we've come to the conclusion that we're entering the fourth quarter of our lives. That shouldn't be looked upon as a bad thing. It's just, it's a fact. So we're starting to think about retirement and what that could look like, what that means for us. Um, all sorts of questions around that. Um, when do we retire? How much money do we need to retire? Where do we retire? Uh, that's a big one. That'll be a large topic for us in this uh, YouTube channel is where, because we've been actively hunting, trying to find, uh, find a place maybe to live in retirement. Maybe it's a... Uh, kind of a snowbird thing where we're there a part of the time, or maybe it's a full-time thing. Could be, because right now we live on the water and it's beautiful during the summertime. Yeah, but it's freezing in the winter. <laughs> and, With a lot of shoveling. Uh, I, in particular, do not like snow and do not like cold. So that's why we are uh, actively hunting for somewhere different. And we've also thought, is there a way to earn some passive income during our retirement? So how can we maybe retire a little bit earlier if we have some, uh, some other uh, ways to make some money? So that's, again, along the lines of uh, digital nomads. There's a lot of those out there that are working all over the world doing things, uh, whether it be uh, on the internet or, or even locally, but um, that is a popular thing. So that's really what this YouTube channel is going to be all about. Each week we'll take a different topic and break it down and... Uh, Give you our perspective on it well and i think it's an opportunity for us to share it's at our experience so this is our experience it's not going to be a one size fits all but we're really trying to figure it out and now that things have changed with people retiring younger because we both have 10 years that we could work um, but are trying to choose not to do that so that will also come through in a lot of these, but again, it's our experience and we hope that as we learn, we can share some of the information that we have found that might be helpful if you decide to take that big step and do the same thing. Yeah, excellent point. Everybody has a different path in life and especially our family, they just think we're crazy. We've been looking at Mexico in particular. We've done, I guess, three trips down there now trying to uh, trying to look at some properties and figure out what, what that could mean for us. And yeah, they all think we're nuts. Yeah, and we're gonna give you the good, the bad, the ugly on things too, because we've learned, I think, quite a bit. We've had a few bumps and hitches, yeah. and I think we're learning as much about ourselves, our relationship, as well as where we want to land. Yeah, exactly. And so yeah, some of the things we'll, we'll talk about, because we've already looked into this, is do you buy property or do you rent property? That, that's a huge, <laughs> it's a huge conversation that we go back and forth on. Um, there's pros and cons to both of those. And we don't quite see eye to eye. I'm a cancer, that's my sign, and I'm a crab, so I like to carry my home on my back. So I think it'll be a little bit of a spicy debate on how to pursue uh, where we end up and what that looks like on buying or renting. Yeah. And similarly with the home we live in here on the lake, um, do we sell this home or do we just rent it when we're not here? So yeah, lots of um, lots of things to think about as we as we move into this. And throwing into that, we should mention that we have two lovely doodles that are going to actually share our journey. So some of what you're going to get too will be our experiences looking at a home for them as well because they are one and two years old. Yeah, so whatever we do, um, they're coming with us. In fact, one of them is on his way over to meet us right now. So I will leave you with this thought today. We've both been reading some philosophy recently 
Yeah, in particular, uh, Seneca, who is an ancient Stoic. Um, and I, I read this quote the other day, and it kind of hit me as we were kind of kicking off this YouTube channel. But uh, the goodness of life does not depend on life's length, but upon the use we make of it. So why don't you reflect on that for this week and um, definitely subscribe. We'd love you to subscribe to the channel. Um, we're, we expect you to subscribe to the channel, especially if you're family. We will hunt you down if you do not subscribe. <laughs> well, and also leave some comments too, things that might interest you because we haven't gotten it all figured out. We are feeling like the tip of the iceberg. There's a lot underneath to consider. And, you know, if there's something particularly that you are interested in, we don't mind digging into it because it may work for us as well. Yep. All right. Well, that's it for this week. And uh, we will see you next week.